Voting for the NBA's MVP race might have ended back in March, but here are the top candidates for the league's MVP. And it should come as to no surprise, the players on that list. Harden leading the league and scoring with a little over 34 a game. The reigning MVP, Giannis, is averaging close to 30 points a game, and he has his Bucks, of course, first in the East. And then there is King James, who leads the league in assists in year 17. His head coach, Frank Vogel, thinks there's no debate on why the King is the most valuable. Nobody impacts winning more than LeBron James. Um, I do believe that, that he should be the MVP this year. I believe that he should be the MVP, and I believe Anthony Davis should be the Defensive Player of the Year. Uh, I hope those awards uh, go to our two players. Um, that's not to take anything away from some of the other candidates, but uh, from, from what LeBron means to, to our team, um, even before the season, season begins, when the roster is being put together, uh, with the number of guys that are on the Lakers because LeBron James is here and want to play with him. Uh, I think it starts there, um, you know, and then obviously, you know, what he's able to do on the basketball court, orchestrating the offense, uh, leading the league in assists, and really setting a tone uh, on the defensive end. We're the third, third best defense in, in the NBA, uh, best in the West, and, um, you know, a lot of that comes from his commitment this season, which has been been greater than uh, the last few years, uh, from what I'm told, uh, has really, you know, set us apart in terms of uh, being the, the, the best re record currently in the Western Conference. And uh, like I said, I'm hopeful uh, those two awards go to those two players. As far as the MVP race, I think I, um, you know, show what I'm capable of doing. Um, um, you know, not only individually, but from a team's perspective, I was being number one in the West. Um, there was a lot of conversation about, you know, LeBron can do those things in the East, but if he ever came to the West, what can he do? <laughs> you know, uh, so, you know, I heard all of that. And uh, to be able to, to, to have our team at, at the top of the Western Conference and, and playing the way that we were playing at that time and the way I was playing, um, you know, that's, a, that's definitely a good feeling.